Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I had no plans to record a purchase video right after the offer came out. You can see that at the time that this was purchased, there was only 12 minutes into the offer. And I don't know when this is going to appear on my channel, clearly not 12 minutes into the offer. But I just feel like I'm dreaming. And like I know that might seem weird to dream about a mobile game, and that probably means you have an addiction of which I would be guilty of. But I'm so used to seeing even a Thronebreaker daily card be so average. I'm so used to seeing them say, oh, you want six tier two alpha by itself, 50 bucks. You want three tier five basic by itself, 45 bucks. You want five Cavalier Nexus crystals, 30 bucks. But the tier five class catalyst crystals, the 100% fully formed, like I'm looking at that right now and I'm like, I don't want that to go away. I don't want to log into the game in an hour and then Kabam Mike be like, uh, upon further review, uh, we realized that uh, we made a mistake and this was supposed to be $100 and not include the tier 5 class count. I just didn't want that to be a potential world that I lived in. So I immediately purchased it just to see if it was real. Just to see if it was real. They even split up the tier two alpha in the signing bonus. I mean, it's real. I'm going to have to take a screenshot of this real quick. One sec. <laughs> okay. Thank you for humoring me on that. Wow. We have some things to open. Now, I do think I'm going to save my six star for tonight, but we're going to open the Cavalier Nexus, and most importantly, we're actually going to end with these. Again, two Tier 5 Class Catalyst Crystals. Why does that sound familiar? Well, it sounds familiar because if you go to Special Quests and you go to the Abyss of Legends and you look at the View Rewards... There we go. Anyhow, you get two Tier 5 Class Catalyst Crystals. Now, obviously, you get a six-star Generic Awakening Gem, which is the main draw, and the Abyss Nexus. But you get two, you get the same amount of Tier 5 Class Catalyst fully formed. I just... $50 is such a reasonable price for all this because there's so much guaranteed value, especially for rank-up materials in it. Um, all right. I don't even know if I care if there's anything in these, but obviously now I want to get greedy and I want to say, give us a six star. <laughs> all right. This is a bonus. This is all bonus. At least give me a one five star, right? Minimum. And we're starting out with the five star Nexus. Of course we are, because it's just that kind of day. I mean, this is all bonus. This is all just a throw in. Okay. I guess I'll save that Nexus for... Uh, my live stream too. And second one is, okay, three stars and four stars. I think I need Cosmic Iso more, so we're going to confirm that. Gosh, we're going to have a lot to open tonight. Happy start to the month. Um, I'm just trying to process all this. My brain's not doing very well. Uh, okay, again, this is normal. I love that five-star Nexus now. It's giving us the norm. We've got two more shots at a six-star Nexus or a six-star champion. Not that I expect it, but it would be nice. And hey, our second five-star Venom the Duck. We will take that. So that's a five-star Nexus and a bonus five-star out of what truly is bonus crystals. Do I hear, no matter what, we're going to have 40% drop rate at five stars. Do I hear anything else? Yes, I do. What's up, Prom Date Invisible Woman? That is a 60% drop rate for 5 stars and or 5 star Nexus Crystals because we got 3 out of 5. Look at that. And again, what would Kabam... Think about this. For the Blade Mythic Crystal, they charge $49.99, right? That's either... You either get a 5 star or a 6 star. No matter what, it's one champion. But chances are you're going to get a 5 star for 50 bucks. 1,000 6 star shards and 3 greater champion boost, the 30% variety. For the same price as all of this. I mean, it's it's a joke to even put them in the same sentence. This is what 
my channel has been preparing for for five years to break down this level of an offer to the community. If you're a throne breaker, you have won today. All right, we're going to save that Nexus. What's up, four-star Nexus? We're going to save that Nexus for tonight. Make this video a little short. We will pop the, uh, the bonus one. Now notice six-star shards. I'm up to 12, 580. I did, unfortunately, open my six-star feature last night, so I can't get a 13,000 for a couple weeks. Um, okay. I'm not even going to discuss what class I'm looking for on these. I'm just going to... I'm just going to open them and then we'll discuss options. Again, Kabam could have just charged 50 bucks for two of these. If they had just given us one of these, I know it's not a selector, but it would have been the most generous they've ever been. I hope that doesn't mean March is going to be a painful month. Like, it's sort of like if your parents are getting divorced and so they take the family out for a nice vacation and to, to get everybody's good mood before they drop a bomb on in terms of news. I have such trust issues with Kabam over the years that when something really nice happens, like before patch 12.0, they gave us for the first time ever a four-star awakening gem selector so you could finally awaken your Scarlet Witch or OG Thor or Doctor Strange, etc. before they nerfed them like two months later. This sort of feels like that. Because we just don't have anything to compare this to outside of this. All right, slowing down. What class is it going to be? I am so happy with that. You can never have too many mutant catalysts. I was kind of worried it was going to be Mystic, and I wasn't sure who I would use it on. And that probably means I just spoke Mystic into existence for this one. But, boy, you can never have too many mutant catalysts. Oh, man. Now I need to awaken Archangel. And then take him to rank three with that catalyst. Wow. There's just so much to process. I don't know what else to say. It's just, it's so much better than anything we've ever seen. And uh, I'm here for it, you know? And I hope the Cavalier and Uncollected and other people still got a really good deal. Obviously, Thronebreakers are going to get the best because it's the highest progression level. But wow. Just, just wow, YouTube. Just wow. All right, can I get back-to-back -back mutants? That's one of those rare times where I'm like, sure, give me the same class. I'd be happy with it. There's two yellows. Cosmic? Beautiful. That means... I mean, look at that. I You expect to see that when you explore the Abyss and you spend thousands of units and, and countless hours. You don't ex expect that for 50 bucks in an instant purchase. Um, sorry, free-to-play players. This is, uh, this is probably going to be... Hard to watch. Um, I have three out of three now for Cosmic Catalysts. And two out of three for Mutant. And I needed the Cosmic because I'm going to take Corvus to rank four as my first rank four. I'm 95% I'm certain. Um, does that mean... Should I take Venom to rank three? I think I want to. I think that would really excite me. That would be such a cool bonus rank up on Kabam in honor of this. Because I love Venom. I use him quite a bit. Especially for Cavalier Event Quest. That would be a cool way to celebrate this. In honor of our beloved Mama Bear who's obsessed with Tom Hardy and Venom. For different reasons than me. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for being a part of this. I'm so happy. we got so much to open tonight too on the stream. I hope to see you at 9 o'clock Central Standard Time. Until then, have a good one.